Hey guys, Yana here, and in this video, I am doing the love reading for October 15th, uh, 2018 until October 30th, 2018 for the following sign of... Now, if this reading does not resonate with you, you have to take in consideration that this reading is general it may or may not resonate because not every single person of your sign is going through the same exact thing okay so it would be in your best interest to book a private reading now i have multiple readings i have readings that start as low as seven dollars and all the way up to 97 okay so there is basically a reading that will uh, work for anyone okay because I understand that everyone is in different um, places when it comes to their finances okay so let's uh, get into the reading I'm gonna pull my cards and we're gonna get into the reading I just kind of wanted to do something a little different I wanted to show my face because um, I know in like my other videos I did it so I want you guys to see that I'm real I'm here and let's get into your reading okay um... Oh yeah, Virgo. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. Okay. So Virgos, I'm going to ask your spirit guys, what is the overall energy for Virgos October 15th to October 30th in 2018? October 31st, I meant to say. What is their overall energy? All right, guys, so your overall energy is the three of wands reverse. So there is a lack of progress in your relationship. There are setbacks. Things are not moving forward. Um, your partner may even be at a distance from you. So you might be like in a long distance relationship and things are failing right now. Um... You may even like want to travel to see them and you're not in a position where you can right now. But what I feel intuitively is that you may possibly be in a, like in a, in a relationship with someone who is at a distance. And when I say long distance, like more than like 30 minutes away from where you live at. To me, that I would consider that long distance, whatever. They don't live in the same town as you. <laughs> but like that. They may live in the same state but not the same town whatever um yeah and there's there's no progress and they were being deceptive and the truth came out about it so it everything that they were doing came out and now you're like feeling really stuck in your head you're like in limbo you kind of don't know what to do, but you're trying to gain like a new a new perspective on the whole situation with them. Yeah, you you you're definitely gaining a new perspective. Like you're going within, and you're like looking at everything that happened, and you're seeing it for what it is. And you're like, I'm no longer gonna put any more work into this. You're like, for what? You know, and you want more balance. You want more fairness. You're like, I, I don't deserve this. So how are you going to balance out the scales is you're no longer going to put any work into it. So what I feel intuitively is like, this person is at a distance from you. And they were telling you like, yeah, I want something solid. I want something real. And it came out that that was not the truth. And you're like, yo, I invested mad time and energy into you. Like, I, I used to have to travel to come see you. I used to have to put gas in, in, in my car and pay like a hundred dollars just to go see you um you know like i i had to um put mileage on my car to come see you 
I had to take off of work sometimes to come see you. Like, I put in mad effort just to, like, be with you. And you told me you wanted this, but it was all a lie. See that? Double reverse. So you're releasing this. Okay, so I want to know, how does um, the person that the Virgo is doing, how do they feel? How are they feeling? So you guys, yeah, you guys were like fighting. And it's a fight where like people walk away and they don't feel good. So they don't feel good about this. But they're trying to be logical. They're trying to make head over heart decisions. And they're disappointed too. They're disappointed in themselves. And they see that they disappointed you. And they see that their judgment was not wise. Like what they did was not smart. They they see that they they have poor judgment when it came to what they did, like lying about it. They also feel like they don't have closure with you. So you may have like really cut them off. Like you're like, you're not playing. And one thing about Virgos, like Virgos will cut you the fuck off. They don't care. Virgos are very like, they will give you their all and they love you and everything like that. But once you cross them, they're done with you. Virgos are like that. No, that, that, that's definitely your um, energy. So they feel like they lack uh, closure with you. And yeah, they, they, they walked away not feeling good. And there's they they kind of feel ganged up by you. So like when you were going off on them, they were like probably sitting there not even really defending themselves because they know they messed up. And they they're feeling overwhelmed. They're like, I I don't even know what to say. Okay, so I'm gonna end this reading here. Um, I hope that it resonated with you. If it did not. I'm going to tell you guys to go ahead and book a private reading so you can learn more about your particular situation. That reading was pretty straightforward and straight to the point. Um, yeah. It's crazy because a lot of the readings that I've been doing um, this week, they have been like, everything's kind of all over the place. But this one was pretty straightforward. Okay? So anyways, um, all of the information to book your private reading is in the description below. I want to thank you guys for watching this video, and I will talk to you guys in November. Bye!